Unlocking the meaning of, I hold the view that. Hello, everyone, welcome back to our channel, where we dive into the fascinating world of English language learning. Today, we're going to unravel the meaning and usage of a powerful phrase, I hold the view that. This expression is a cornerstone in both formal and informal English, especially when sharing opinions or making arguments. So, let's get started and explore how you can use this phrase to express yourself more clearly and confidently. I hold the view that, is a formal way to say, I believe, or, I think. It's often used in written and spoken English to introduce a personal opinion or belief about a subject. This phrase adds a layer of sophistication to your language, making your statement sound more thoughtful and considered. You can use, I hold the view that, in various contexts. Academic writing. It's perfect for essays or papers where you need to present an argument or perspective. Formal speeches. When delivering a speech or presentation, it can help articulate your stance on a topic. Debates. It's useful in debates to clearly state your position on an issue. Discussions. Even in less formal discussions, it can be used to express your opinion in a respectful and thoughtful manner. Let's see how this phrase works in sentences. I hold the view that education is the key to solving many of the world's problems. She holds the view that environmental conservation should be a priority for every government. We hold the view that all citizens should have access to free health care. These examples show how you can use the phrase to state your opinions on a wide range of topics. While, I hold the view that, is a great phrase, variety is key to dynamic language use. Here are some alternatives, I believe that. In my opinion, I think that, it is my conviction that, using these alternatives will help you avoid repetition and keep your English vibrant and engaging. There you have it, folks. I hold the view that, is more than just a phrase. It's a tool to express your beliefs and opinions with confidence and sophistication. We hope this video has shed some light on how to use this expression effectively in your English communication. Remember, practicing these phrases will make your language skills stronger and more versatile. Thanks for watching, and we look forward to seeing you in our next video.